GeForce Now is adding over 25 games during the month of October, including 12 titles that are releasing day and date on the platform. Let's talk about it. Are you listening? All right, happy GeForce Now Thursday, everybody. The week is almost over. And as we head into the weekend, just a friendly reminder from your friends at the Nerf Report, stop letting old people use VR. Blue 42, hit! You gotta hold it, keep it held down, and then... <laughs> now, as we mentioned in the intro of this video, NVIDIA just revealed 25 games that will be joining GeForce Now during the month of October. And seeing that we are one of the most innovative channels here on YouTube, I figured in honor of all of these new games, we have to do something so unique, so special, something that nobody else is doing, and that's read you a list of video games from top to bottom. Right off the bat, we have Asteragos, Curse of the Star, which will be available via Steam on October 11th. Kamawaza Way of the Thief will be available via Steam also on October 11th. Ozymandias Bronze Age Empire Sim will be available via Steam, and you guessed it, it will be available on October 11th. Lego Brick Tales is coming to GeForce Now via Steam on October 12th, alongside PC Building Simulator, which will be available via the Epic Games Store on October 12th. On October 13th, the last Oraku will will be available via Steam. The atmospheric horror game Scorn will be available via Steam and the Epic Game Store on GeForce Now starting October 14th. A Playtale Requiem also will be coming to GeForce Now via Steam and the Epic Game Store starting October 18th. Warhammer 40,000 Shoot Us Blood and Teeth arrive on October 20th via the Steam. Faith the Unholy Trinity will be launching via Steam on October 21st. Victoria 3, not to be confused with Victoria 2 or 1. Victoria 3 will arrive on October 25th via Steam, and The Unliving will arrive on Halloween, October 31st via Steam. Now, those are the games that we have confirmed dates for. However, GeForce Now also revealed that Commando 3 HD Remastered, Draw Slasher, Guild Wars Game of the Year, Guild Wars Trilogy, Labyrinthine, Volcanoid, and Monster Outbreak will all gain cloud compatibility via GeForce Now during the month of October. And all of those are titles that will be coming later in the month of October. But just this week, GeForce Now dropped Marauders, Dakar Desert Rally, Lords of Wriggle, Barrow Trauma, Black Desert Online, and Priest Simulator. Oh, hold up. Let's just stop what we're doing. Let's pull up Priest Simulator. I, I, I've got to see this trailer. His teeth were like piranhas. His eyes like ping pong balls. I saw him break into the church. Oh, a priest is a vampire. You don't want to end the party when things get interesting. It told me fuck to run. Fuckballs on a Yeti. What the hell was that? I genuinely thought Priest Simulator was gonna be like a wholesome video game where you run a day-to-day -day church. That looked awesome! Anyway, ton of games coming to GeForce Now. Which of these are you hyped about and why is it Priest Simulator? <laughs> Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I can't believe that's a video game. 